Hi everybody, it's Honest John again. Now, uh, this is my third video uh, in my Eat the Rich playlist, playlist, which will be talking about how the rich cause a lot of our social problems. Now, I started off dealing with poverty and I realized that it's going to take more than one video to deal with all the ways that the rich cause poverty. So this is the third one about that. Another way the rich cause poverty is through exploitation of indigenous or native populations. Here is how that works. When oil or minerals are found in a country overseas uh, with a weak or corrupt government. A corporation will enter in, into an agreement with that government to exploit those resources. And very often there are villages in those areas. So the corporation will say to the government, well, you have to get rid of those people. And then they turn a blind eye as the villagers are forced off their land by the government. So the government gets money, the corporation gets money, the indigenous people get screwed. Uh, sometimes if they're not forced off their land, the mining or drilling operations will ruin the land the people live on. So, like I said, the fat cats get richer and the poor population is plunged into deeper poverty and misery. Usually this kind of stuff happens overseas. But here in the U.S. we have another example of the fat cats causing poverty here in the United States. the oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico. It put a lot of fishermen out of business and hurt the tourism industry all along the Gulf. It also created health problems because the oil industry refused to properly equip the people that they hired to help with the cleanup. So this was a case where the rich not only caused poverty, they made people sick too. Thanks for listening.